back squadron this is crafty ninja here and today I have for you a new season of crafty cards server survival i am here with uh there he is zero and What's um up, guys yeah it's uh as you can see we've already gotten off to a pretty good start i originally wanted to, i originally well this is all this is all uh zero's work over here we, this is my handiwork. Yeah, this is all his handiwork. I helped him out a little bit with that. That's the house he. That's the starter house he built for me. Um, well, it's the spawn house he built for me. Um, but yeah, I originally recorded a first episode for this, but it was it was so bad I did not want to upload it, and then a lot of things happened, and I eventually just lost the will to record for a while, and. I just like, man, I haven't recorded or done any, anything to the channel for a really long time. I should probably get something done. So, here we are today. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, so, uh, we're actually, I'm gonna actually let Crafty go by himself. And, yeah. yeah so, uh, see, uh, hope you guys on Crafty's side enjoy the series. And I'll see you guys when we do a collab together. Bye. Yeah. yeah. So, um, yeah, I'll just give you guys a little bit of a tour around the place for now. So here's uh, Zero's humble little shack over here and then a bunch of his chests. He's been building this tower. I forgot what it's for. I don't even know what it's for, but it looks cool. Um, this is something. <laughs> um, this is, as I said, the house he built for me. It looks pretty cool. I helped design the windows and most and the roof as well. And the front door as well. That thing this looks really cool. And that's also a tower that Zero has been building. I have also have no idea what its purpose is. He's never mind. Um Here's the docks over here. That's actually new. Pretty cool. Um, and then now we have the cave that leads to the nether hub. Again, all made by zero. Looks pretty freaking good. Now, here's the nether hub. Guess who designed it? <coughs> zero. <coughs> Uh, looks pretty cool. That way is to his um, portals, and this way is to my base. We uh, design. I designed the bridge, and well, we just made the entire path and connected it, I guess. And yeah, it's a pretty long path, and you can definitely see the pattern of the bridge as we go along. So. Um, I'm going to just uh, be right back with you guys once we uh, get back to my base. Okay, so here we are back at my base. I built, found a pyramid and, well, decided to build my base inside of it and did a little bit of home decor. Um, I, didn't, I haven't done too much around here because I wanted to do it all on camera, but I've gotten most of the resources I need to do what I was going to do in today's episode, which is, well, build an elevator from all the way down there to here. But, yeah, this is my nice little humble abode. I've mined out a lot of this pyramid just to... This was originally going to be uh, extra space, but now I've just decided to turn it into a stairwell to make it into a, a deeper level that's also wider and probably has more rooms. And out here, we've got the front of the base, nice little um, sugarcane farm that uh, Zero's been helping me out with, and that we'll get to on a, uh, later. And way over there, I'm not going to walk over there because that's just, that's just a waste of time, is a giant pyramid that Zero and I have, been wor have started working on. It this doesn't even look like a pyramid right now, but it's, it's going to be huge. And then this I made while I was bored. And then this I designed, f which for Zero, it was originally, well, spoilers, for a future Redstone video. Um, 
anyways, let's get on to the main agenda here. So, first off, I believe I have... Oh, no, that's a lot of sandstone. Here we go. I need slime. Lots of it. Thank you for... Thank you to Zero for making a giant slime farm. Um, and then... Let's see. Cobblestone, redstone, there we go. Quartz, quartz. Do I have quartz? Huh. Would you look at that? I don't have quartz. So, uh, I guess we'll go out and go get ourselves some of the. Oh, why did I grab my iron pickaxe? I got a diamond one in here. A couple of them in here, actually. Alright, um, let's see. Yeah, that's it. So, I'm gonna go out, grab myself some quartz, and, uh, be right back. Okay, I have pretty much all the resources I need. I just need to get more immovable blocks, but, um, I'm about ready to start building the elevator. So, first off... Oh, well, I guess I could do that. Alright, there we go. Needed a button. Um, the elevator is just going to be this wide, but considering I don't have any movable objects, I need to make more. Um, okay. I don't know how big wow, it is. is what the crap? Also, zero is back. I don't know if you can hear me or not, so I'll just mute myself. There we go. Um, <laughs> and... Okay. I think this is deep enough. Now, my memory doesn't fully serve me correctly, because I have no full idea of how to make this. If I remember correctly, it was like this. I don't know. Um, this hole needs to be wider. I forgot to return the slime balls into slime blocks. Oh my goodness. Alright, we'll be back. Okay. So, we're back. Um, I just realized I made this one too low. And this needs to be... That's, that's, the, that's ground level, so... We dig all of this out. It doesn't need to be this big, but you know, it, it helps to have space. It also helps to have a little bit of light, but you know, things. I'm kind of playing it a little bit on the cheap side right now. Alright, so if my memory serves me correctly, which again probably doesn't. Which way is the, that's that's the front, alright, and Okay. Don't remember what that's there for, but we'll figure it out. Now, 
close it like that. A second. Um, kind of can't right now. Um, one moment. Okay, that should be the elevator done, but now I gotta dig out this entire shaft. Which, in order to do so, I need to, you know, go from top to bottom. So, uh, I'll get back to you guys on that one. I also need to bit make the redstone for the, you know, the, re the, the, the return signal. Which, again, I'll get back to you guys on that one. So, uh, let's have some fun. Okay, that's the entire tunnel dug out. Now, we just test the way up. There we go. <laughs> that's great. Oh, gosh. All right. That's something to be mindful about. Oh, uh, let me in, let me in, let me in. No! Welp. <laughs> That's a thing. Uh, well, at least I know it gets me to the top. Sometimes. Okay, we're back. Now, I need to fix this. Where's my flint and steel? I need the return system. Which, if I remember correctly... I need a lot of space over here for this. And an empty inventory. I'll need those. More chests. I don't have any wood. All right, that'll have to do. All right, um, over here. So the, the observer stops right there. Gosh dang it. Observer right there. Yes! Whew. Okay. Okay, now we get. I believe it was a block with repeater facing out of it. Vortex. Facing into another block. That leads to a pulse extender. to a redstone torch, but that's too high. Huh. That's too low, I mean. Cause 
because it needs to activate the piston. Alright, I know what I'm doing. Just need to dig out that way a little bit more. How much headspace do I have? Not enough. I lost a bit of redstone, did I? No? Okay, good. Now I just go like that. Gosh dang it, I wish I wasn't... didn't have an efficiency pickaxe right now. There we go. Alright, let's just move the food. That way. And that way. That was weird. Double redstone. Redstone torch right there. Lock up like that. And observer. Hopefully if I can place it right. Facing that way. Good. That'll be the return system. If I can get out of this, that might be grand. There, return system. I just noticed my fatal mistake. I can't get down there anymore. This isn't going to get rid of any redstone, so if I could just get a bucket of water. There we go. Alright. Take two hundred thousand. All right, um, off we go. How did I get hurt there? No. Come on, we're almost there. Nailed it. All right. And the return didn't work. Which side is it on again? I can't remember. Is it right here? Yes. Why didn't the return work? I built it on the wrong side. <laughs> uh. So close. Yet so far. Poosh. That's it. <laughs> it is complete. Five deaths later. 
now. I need to <laughs> A, go get more slime. And B. Yeah, just do some mining or something. I don't know. <laughs> go get some. Go get some wood to make some chests. That's what I'm gonna go do. <laughs> Hold on a second. And, uh, make as many of those as I can, which is not enough. All right. Elevator is complete. I just need to go do. Something real quick. Where is my axe? There it is. Sword. Alright, I'm gonna go get some wood so I can make some chests. I'm also going to go get some slime from the slime farm. So I can get more slime blocks to put at the bottom of my elevator in case it pushes me off again. So yeah, we'll be right back. Okay, I got more chests. Now to go down and put slime blocks around the outer edges of this thing. Hopefully, I got enough. Yeah, I got enough. I can count. That is a hole. Whoops. He's paused. I forgot about that good old hollow floor concept. <laughs> no, he can hear us. He's just talking to himself. No, he would have muted, muted himself by now. Right now, uh, Zero is talking about Crimson. All the way back up here, and just do this. Okay, let me just mute myself so we don't hear him. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Understorm. Great. I think that'll look nice. Should do it for the elevator that is and for the episode now let's see if I can do the outro while staying on the elevator all right guys that'll do just about do it for us this episode thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed leave a like and subscribe for content <laughs> anyways I'll see you guys sometime in a similar squadron later see you guys I made it! Yes! Okay. See ya.